So a request to everyone in the pet industry, particularly with people that run social media, and absolutely to all of you Australian YouTubers. So in Australia, one of the concerns that the industry faces is people releasing aquarium fish. Now, if people are releasing aquarium fish for um, cultural reasons, or they just don't want the fish anymore, then this is a major problem and a huge threat for our industry. If aquarium fish start showing up more regularly, it has not been a major problem in Australia, but it is a problem, um, then these are the sorts of reasons that the government needs to clamp down on our industry. On the other hand, if the industry is being pr very proactive and the government sees us supporting and helping them with um, this particular issue, then it's a sort of issue that can actually work in our, in our best interest, um, particularly if the problem is not really occurring. And I believe that education is the real answer. So I believe that people rarely dump fish due to some sort of malice or some sort of um, eco-terrorism um, or anything like that. I believe that people dump fish because they don't know that it's a big problem they think that their fish isn't going to make a difference or they feel like they have no other alternatives. So if you are a YouTuber or if you do have a social media account, I really ask that you can incorporate a little bit of um, this education. So if you do get a chance, um, if you could go to the PIAA um, YouTube channel and watch the PIAA Never Dump Aquarium Fish or Plants, and then just have a watch of this video. And what this video will do is outline some of the points that you might want to just be aware of. Um, the long and short of it is um, if you have a fish and you don't want the fish, then don't release it into a natural waterway. Um, you're not doing any favor to the actual fish and you might actually be putting native fish at a huge risk either due to the fact that it's an invasive species or um, due to potential disease um, issues. So we really want to educate any um, cultural situations where people may release fish because they think it's good karma or some other thing like that. But if you release a fish and then that fish becomes an invasive species and wipes out a whole lot of um, native fish, maybe you're going to end up with some bad karma. So if the industry can be very much aware that we need to be encouraging people not to dump their fish or plants. And the next thing is we need to be educating people, what do you do with them? So we really encourage all of the PIAA stores or any store in Australia to accept um, fish. And when people bring fish back these days, we're really calling it, you're going to rehome it. Because in the old days, people used to bring fish back and they expected credit. And then some shops stopped accepting fish. And it's not that they didn't want the fish. It's just that people would lob up with bucket loads of fish and they'd expect credit for it. And if you didn't really want the fish, then suddenly you've got a pissed off person that had an expectation and um, you don't even want the fish and suddenly you've got a, a, a um, situation that you didn't ask for. So some people are like, oh, blow that. We're not going to accept fish from hobbyists. So what we're really encouraging is that you um, have a quarantine tank. And when you accept a fish from a hobbyist, you put it in the quarantine tank. Because what we do not encourage you to do is have a fish system and then introduce a customer's fish into the fish system because that way your good deed of accepting the fish, therefore reducing the chance of it being dumped in a natural waterway, um, can be a major problem if that fish results in your fish getting a disease. So I highly encourage that every single person that um, accepts fish, don't put them in your systems, put them into a separate quarantine, then once the fish are um, proven themselves and you're sure they're not diseased and you can do whatever you like with them. But we're really encouraging every single shop to have a rehoming program and to accept fish if they are um, dropped off. So I guess I'm making a plea to 
all of the social media people, please promote Don't Dump This Fish and Why to your um, influence and to all the stores. I'm really asking to please accept fish because we need to have an alternative to people dumping fish. And if you get a fish that you can't deal with, then I do encourage you to contact the PIAA because we can help be involved in rehoming any fish. So as an industry, we need to be very conscious of the um, things that can affect our industry and the releasing of um, ornamental plants or fish, I would say is right up there, very high on our list. So let's get the education out there. Let's let everyone know that it is not okay to dump fish and um, let's give them the alternatives.